take my job very seriously, but it's not just a job to me. I get really attached to patients. All my colleagues do as well. And when you've put a lot of time and effort into looking after a patient, when all of that hard work comes to nothing and that patient unfortunately doesn't make it through, it's just heart wrenching. I suppose after the first lockdown, we sort of knew how long that was. So when the second wave came along, we thought, right, we've got an end point to this. We know how long it was last time, we can get through it. But then the third wave came, the fourth wave came, <laughs> and we're still in it now. So it's just really hard to see an end point. What keeps me in the job is definitely the feedback that you get from patients. We've had a patient recently who was with us last year and he remembers me. It made me cry actually because I couldn't believe that he could still remember me. That makes it all worth it really. We've got 43,000 vacancies at the minute and rising. In the last year we've had maybe about 12 of our staff leave and you've got to talk about pay at the end of the day. 20% pay cut in the last 10 years. There's no wonder why people are leaving. Why work in a job where you don't feel like you're getting paid to do the job that you're doing? You're keeping people alive at the end of the day. <laughs> Let's hope that the government help with us and we'll get there. It's weird looking at me like that. But I'd definitely say the hands, they're a comforting part of your body. You have to hold people's hands. I've had to do that a lot. And it's just so detailed and intricate. I'm very impressed. I just feel grateful that we're being recognised for what we've achieved and what we continue to achieve. And it just shows there are people out there that are really, really grateful for our work and what we do. Thank you. I think this is what people forget is that it's not just the doctor or the nurse. We have a huge team of people. We've got physios, we've got cleaners, we've got admin staff, everything like that, that just help with just one patient. And it's amazing to actually see all of that team together. We've been there for each other through thick and thin. It's definitely developed us all as, as nurses and clinical staff, but also as friends. We need to remember to be kind to each other at the end of the day, we're one planet, we all need to work together and be nice to each other. Thank you.